All right, guys, at the end of every, oh, almost knocked my whole setup over. At the end of every SAS, they send us a 20% coupon, 20% off coupon of the additional things they're trying to get rid of. Let me just move that a little bit. Okay, that's better. And I went in today. Actually, I didn't do too bad because I got a bunch of other stuff taking part off. So this was an in-store haul of items that were just too good to pass up for the rest of it. Is this my last haul? No, I'll probably do one more online haul for things that just aren't in store. I got Ocean. Now, you guys know I'm a 75% off shopper. However, this was 50% off with an additional 20% off, so I let it slide. This is Ocean and Fabric Care Detergent. Now, they had the booster beads, not in Ocean though. This is Blue Cypress, Vet Vetiver, and Coastal Air. I am somebody who's laundry doesn't have to be super fragrant um however my husband does like super fragrant the light it just like my dog <laughs> hold on he just like opened the door like super wide but i can't leave the door open because i should probably wait till i come back okay i can't leave the door open because the bugs will fly in it's georgia <laughs> So he loves super fragrant uh, laundry detergent. I'm not a huge fan of super fragrant laundry detergent, but I knew he would like this. He's worn Ocean before. It is a part of their men's care line and I know he was gonna like really like this. So not only did I get one, I got two at $7.98 a piece. Um, that could be good depending on how many loads you can get out of it. That's something we don't know. And I guess we won't really know until the sale's over. So these are our little testers. This, these, and um, What's the other one? Eucalyptus mint we got. These are our testing scents. Yes. Okay. Next thing I got was, these were $3 a piece, like a flat $3. Are they the same price? Yeah. Okay. So this one's actually a dollar more. So this was a little less than $3. But this was $3 and it's coffee and whiskey body spray. This is my favorite scent in the men's care line. This in, I think, Noir or Flannel Noir? Noir. Something Noir. Um... This smells like if you're back in the day, Bath and Body Works. And I've been I've been shopping Bath and Body Works since I can walk my little legs in there. This smells like chocolate amber. And I used to love chocolate amber. I used to wear chocolate amber. But this is Irish whiskey, roasted coffee, and hints of vanilla. Mm. There's some chocolate in there. They can't convince me otherwise. So I got him a set, 75% off plus the additional 20% off. Um something weird happened y'all so I got this as my free item it is half empty but the weird thing is it's not half empty like it's spilled because it's very clean it's just half empty so um that's unfortunate what I'll probably do is fill it with I'll probably use it and then fill it again with something else just to feel like I used it but like goodness gracious like what happened there waste of a free item I'm still gonna use it I'm gonna take it out of town of course um the next thing I found is In the Stars exfoliating, exfoliating Body Scrub. Exfoliating Glow Body Scrub. They did a really good job with this um, packaging. The notes are Starflower, Sandalwood Musk, Sugar Tangelo, White Agarwood, and Radiant Amber. The only thing about these, and this I just noticed in one of my other videos, it smells so good. Um, one thing I noticed about these is they don't tell you what the scrub component is, which is probably what, why I don't like them. It's probably not coarse enough and I like a coarse scrub. So I've started using the hand glove that, so you can really get a good scrub in. It does scrub, it's just not to my liking. So adding the little glove makes it to my liking. In the stars, the scent is really, 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 really light, which is kind of, good and kind of not good it mixes well with other scents for that reason but otherwise you're not going to smell it afterwards i found one <laughs> this one's sitting right there by itself i think this was four dollars after the additional 20 percent off oh no it was 339 even better of the oh <laughs> let me finish my sentence i've owned this is pure wonder so pure wonder is ice rose star jasmine warm white amber Yes, love this scent. Pure Wonder is so good, you guys. 
it's one of those like gifting candles so it says something so you can just put it in a bag and gift it with something else i will save it i'll save it until the end of all my single wicks and if it's still sitting there i'm gonna burn it because i love the set <laughs> but otherwise i'm gonna save it see if anyone is the best and deserves it i don't know the only other scents that were single wicks that were left where i went um were espresso and li lavender yeah it that scent is weird. I gave it a, I gave it a chance because of the espresso. No, don't do, don't. Mm. This was my little splurge, you guys. I still don't know how I feel about this or why I bought it. This thing, I think was like $7. I think it was, which is super annoying because that's just too much. I just feel like, was this 75% off? How much is this? It's $30. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how much this thing was because I'm a little unimpressed with it. And in oh, it was where is the cost of this thing? Oh, here it goes. It was six dollars. Um, it does it does have the scent thing. I I have to buy these now because I'm just so used to it. This is the scent control is what they call it, but it also lights up. Really, I don't really care if they light up or do anything else as long as they're scent control, which is why I got it. It is very beautiful scene. Does this match anything in my whole house? It does not. It makes absolutely no sense to be here. But the scent control got me. I am very meh about this product. Very. Um, it's cute, but like, why is it so large? <laughs> Anyways, the next thing I got was and i'm gonna i'm gonna open this so i can show it to you i got the bridal dot kit it's literally on the receipt as the dot kit underscore bridal if you don't know what a dot kit is it's typically like some sort of bag that opens the long way and so you can open it like wide so you can put small items in it that would be for travel or just literal small items it's typically a bag the hardware on this is really good and i love silver hard hardware on bags so i really like this i like that it has bath and body works on the zipper pull it has a little mirror which is so cute and it has a leather backing that's also stamped bath and body works this thing was cute and i didn't see this before it's a regular 20 dollars. i got it for four my friend got one too. There was literally two left. So we were pretty impressed by that. It has the tag. This Bath and Body Works. The white on white is really nice. I'm glad that's not another color. I'm glad the mirror is not another color. Every, there's nothing in here except um, bag stuff. Like stuff to stuff the bag. But I'm going to go ahead and take that out because I'm going to use this to fill up with hand sanitizers that I'm about to show you. So... I'm going to show you these wallflowers first. I did pick up two. Oh, actually, I didn't pick these up. My friend traded me for these. She traded me a couple of items that I've hauled in the past for spring clothesline. It's a good scent. It's nothing special. Um, she did open it, though, before. She opened it to smell it. And spring clothesline is lemon water, sun-dried blossoms, and golden amber. I liked amber. I Honestly, she was asking me did I want to trade. And I was like, yeah, sure. I didn't even... And she was like, you didn't smell it. And I was like, I really just... There's very few scents that I'm like, ew, no, I cannot. <laughs> so I figured I was fine. Yeah, it's all right. It's, it's, if I didn't already have two, I would call that a one and done <laughs> for sure. So that is probably going to be the next thing I start. Because anytime I have two of something, I feel more inclined to use one of them. I don't know what that is. So those were a free trade. She brought that over. We went together to the store. Now, I'm going to fill this bad boy up with hand sanitizer. This is just so cute. I cannot, I'm probably going to travel with this like all summer. Like this, this is so cute. Honestly, $20, I don't know. I don't know. It has the, uh, it has the wiping inside, but $20, I'm trying to, I'm trying to justify that cost. It is very nice, but 15, I would say 15 at the most. Anyways, let's get to going. I got Sunshine and Lemon. Now, these are all 39 cents. Sunshine and Lemon. With the, that, that's 39 cents with the 20% off already applied. Champagne Toast. Brightest Bloom. Another Champagne Toast. Brightest Bloom again. K 
Kitchen Mandarin, which I've never smelled this in. I've never seen this one before. I've also never seen Brightest Bloom, but I do. I just smelled it in the thing. Uh, Calypso Clementine. I love that scent. Brightest Bloom is okay. It has a very green note to its floral note. So, mm. Wouldn't repurchase or repurchase at a regular price. I got two more of the Banana Bonanza lip glosses. These lip glosses just come in so handy. And at $2, the scent is great. I love having a lip gloss on hand regardless of where I am in every bag. Um, I got a Pink Pineapple Sunrise, which this is the only one that was in there. So I was like, is this even supposed to be in here? This was the one that I was a little suspicious of. Oh, I didn't tell you guys, the Banana Bonanza with the additional 20% off, which I paid regular 75% off on the last haul, but this one was 179. Like can't even get a regular with gloss like that anymore. So definitely coming with me. Oh, okay. So the Pink Pineapple, pink pineapple Sunrise was 39 cents. Um, that was this one and then i have kitchen mandarin again sunlit palm trees i don't know why i said it like that sunlit palm trees <laughs> and we're getting down to the bottom another sunshine lemons another calypso clementine and guys i went out on a ledge and got one ice lemon pound cake there were so many of these left but you guys know i've had a terrible experience with these like gourmand scents on hand sanitizers. I'm gonna put a little couple drops there. We're gonna rub our hands together, give it time to air out. It's very thin. That feels like a thinner formula. I don't know. <sighs> Wish me luck. It's, first of all, ice lemon pound cake could go very cereal or it can go very pound cake. I'm getting cereal which already is just like, ugh. Gourmand hand sanitizers don't make sense. They don't. <laughs> I'm gonna use it, but it's definitely gonna be on in an area that's gonna make me use it, like near my car. Like in like my car, where I keep the hand sanitizers in my car, I usually like end up using those for sure all the way through regardless of the scent because I just need something, you know? But this is my little cute dop kit. It's not very structured as a dop kit. Most dop kits have a little bit more structure. This one is more like just a makeup bag because like I shouldn't be able to do that. All right, that's cute. Oh, a little battery. Okay, you guys, let's wrap this up. My last but not least item that was 75% off plus an additional 20% off. After I saw the price on the receipt, I should have ran back and got the other one. There was only two left. And when I say I got... Calypso Clementine, the perfume. Oh, I almost dropped it. Now, I was not interested in this for $54.99. I was not interested in it for half of that, 27 something. I don't know. But when it went 75% off, I said, yes, I will take one. Because um, one thing I will get perfumes that I like for 50% off, perfumes that I'm not sure about, I will wait for 75% off and just let everybody have their fill before me. Now, nobody grabbed this. So it was... I kid you not, this perfume was $10.99, a perfume, a 1.7 ml. Oh, hold on, let me. Them in this new packaging that gets like super cute. Bam. It's really nice though. The front is also mirrored on the back here. And oops. why did Alexa just start talking? I'm trying to get this perfume out, but okay. The bottle is like this. This is the perfect, yes, I, I love a cheap perfume. Y'all don't understand my cheapness. I love wearing a cheap perfume to work. I don't like wearing my good perfume to work. I'm not even really trying to be there. <laughs> Calypso Clementine, this cheap perfume is like perfect for me. Like it has so many uses. Um, places where I'm not trying to like crazy dress to impress, but I want the smell to last. When I'm running to the body, like the store, when I'm going to the movie theater, I will put on some body splash, like body spray, body splash, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, work, I'm not wearing my good stuff to work. They're going to get $10.99. So, and it all still smells good. This is Juicy Clementine, Neroli Nectar, and Coastal Woods. You guys, I was so excited to see this. 
I was so excited to see this, you guys. Oh my gosh. And I cannot believe that price. The bottle is really beautiful. Honestly, they can switch all the bottles to the shape. Because one thing about the Luminous, love, love, love that scent. But the shape of the bottle is really weird. Anyways, that was my last in-store haul. Like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this. And have a great day.